and this is our local annual chapter business report. I am here with I'm John Kelter. And we will be presenting for Bear River High School today. So we've done a lot of things to encourage our members to find passions in the business world and also get them involved in FBLA so they can learn more. year we have 22 members. Um, this did have a little bit of a decline from last year just because of COVID restrictions and other things, but out of the 13 clubs offered at Bear River High School, FBLA is among the largest. And our membership, um, we are hoping to increase more next year and to continue to increase and get more people involved in FBLA. So we also have some of the activities we do, like our program of work, which would be our FBLA Jeopardy. So each year we try and do as many of the spaces as we can and just keep getting better at them and fill them out as much as we can to help benefit us in FBLA. We also do Red Rex Week, which is along with our high school. It's a week where all the clubs of our high school are out in the commons and we try and recruit as many members as we can for the week. So another great thing is we do school announcements here. And on the school announcements, we keep FBLA members informed about upcoming events and other things like that, but we also teach the students a little bit more about FBLA and they get to understand it a little bit more. And we recognize the students who are working hard for state and region competitions. So another thing we did this year was our t-shirts. We went off of our theme Aspire this year. We wanted to create a shirt that everybody could wear around school. So we did Aspire to Be. And our two things that we want to put across towards FBLA and to have people be impacted by is to become successful and to become a leader. Those two things are a big thing for us and we hope that each member of FBLA can be a contributing member of society and to be those things in life. And you can take them anywhere you go. Mm -hmm. Another great thing that we do is our Dress for Success and our internships. So we do internships here at Bear River High School which is a great way to get out in the field that you're looking at and see if it's a great place for you or if somewhere else would be better for you. It's a great way to learn more about the things that you want to do. We also do um, our Dress for Success and those are the days that you dress up and you can get professional development points. So we learn more about how to be professional, how to dress professionally, how to speak professionally so we can be prepared for the working world. And we also do the Black Feather Chamber of Commerce. They help fund our FBLA chapter. And a lot of the time that we normally do, like the event with them is our beach days for Brigham City. We sell, we sold raffle tickets last year and a few years before that, but we couldn't this year because of COVID issues. So this year we will be participating in the March of Dimes that's coming up. Um, we did a rose, uh, a rose company here at the school and some of that money will be going towards the March of Dimes. We're also a Goldfield chapter, which we have been for over a decade. And that's a great way for us to be involved. It's definitely um, a great recognition and we love going to state and to be able to participate in the things there. And along with the rose business, technically our rose fundraiser because it goes towards nationals and the March of Dimes as well. We made it for $400 in profit to help fund everyone. And we sold out this year, so we were able to give to the community at a lower cost for Valentine's roses. Another great thing that we have is Sterling Scholars. A few of our members are Sterling Scholars, and they are doing great things in the community and also being a member of FBLA, which is a great accomplishment. our winners for spring 2020 fall for state and winter for northern region. We had a lot of participation and we took home a lot of awards. And everyone who's placed at region, we're sure they're going to place at state. So. Thank you so much for meeting with us today.